Hello and Eid Mubarak. The day starts with getting ready and looking like a strawberry in the outfit that my mum got me. Then we help or pretend to help, set up the table and all the decorations as we are hosting a big Eid lunch for my dad's side of the family. I get the Eid bags ready. None have my name on it, sadly. My henna, which I put on last night, has not really gotten really dark, but, you know, it's not too bad. The food spread is pretty sweet, complete with the cake that my sister sent for us all the way from Texas. I also unbox my little Eid, which is actually a joint effort, but we love our first Emmes. It is finally biryani time. I cannot express the happiness that the smell brings me every time they open it. It is the true definition of Eid for me at home. And then we have lunch with the whole family. It is Eid after all, and we are relentless when it comes to eating. So it is dessert time immediately after. Then starts the games to win more presents. And as usual, it gets heated with threats, lies and cheating. I obviously did not win anything because I don't cheat. After lunch, I have a short nap and then I change my outfit and I start to model in the garden. I then get dragged into checking out the new guava tree planted by my dad with the first guavas which are not even ripe. And here he is showing his custard apples as well. And to wrap up this garden tour, here are some fresh coconuts from our garden. Then we finally hit the road, so come along for some really soothing sceneries of the Mauritius greenery. We make a little detour on the coastal road so that we can enjoy some nice sunset views on our way. And honestly, I love this so much. This is the one thing I will always miss and what makes home really home for me. We're now headed to my mom's sister's house, my khala, for dinner. Spend some time watching Mr. Bean with the kids. She made my favorite sponge cake, which is plain, but amazing so we check it out secretly so we don't have to share she's also recreating my grandmother's recipe of fried bread with this curry where the meat is wrapped around boiled eggs and tied together it is so yummy i don't even know how much i ate unfortunately we're forced to share the cake with others too and we end the night with some tea eat mubarak my loves